like Wednesday's sudden downpour. Forest Meadow Junior High students and parents within Richardson ISD got showered with what might come as a surprise. To invest in magnet locked cell phone bags. Get ready from a to test out these. If we're going to take that student performance to the next level. We need kids to be all in bell to bell. District Superintendent Tabitha Branham announced a pilot program to keep kids from getting distracted by cell phones in class. Originally, she wanted board members this week to approve these cell phone pouches at every middle and high school within the district. Students put their phones inside, they lock, and could be unlocked at the end of the school day or in case of an emergency. But after strong parent reaction, we are looking at piloting. Branham and the district decided to just test the new pouches at Forest Meadow for the start of the semester. At all other secondary schools, turn your cell phones off, keep it in your backpacks, except for at lunch. Um, if we see your cell phone, we're going to take it. The district will compare discipline handed out in both situations, decide which works best, and push forward. Branham's intention is to get students to focus, and any parent can relate. A lot of learning was lost in the pandemic, and teachers don't need the distractions. But some parents cried foul. Many want their kids to not have a phone barrier in case of an emergency. Branham also heard this. The convenience of being able to communicate with them and update them maybe on a schedule change or um, some other kind of family information I think some of our parents feel very strongly with. So the future forecast on cell phones in students' hands and RISD cloudy at the moment, but not for too long. In Richardson, I'm Matt Howerton.